भगवती ही गुरु बबजे गुरु नैव सहास्मे नमो गुरवे न गुरो परम शिशुरस्म गुरो मतिरस्ति गुरो मम पाही गुरो ब्रवीमि संस्कृत वाचा ध्यामी संस्कृत हृदा पूर्वे सेवां वंदे संस्कृत मातर जो नर संस्कृत व्योम ख्याल रमते मुदा संस्कृति चीव संस्कार विंदते नात्र संशय माला सुधा कुंभ विबोध मुद्रा विद्या विराजत्करवारी जाता अपार कारुण्य सुधाबुराशि श्री शारदाबा प्रणतस्म भारती करुणा पात्र भारती पदभूषण भारती पद पदमारूढ़ भारती तीर्थमाश्रिए विद्या विनय संपन्न वीतरागम विवेकिन वंदे वेदात तत्व विधुषे कर खर भारती very very auspicious moment for vyoma we are starting a small course or a study we can call on sadhana panchakam which is shankara bhagavat padas upadesha regarding lalit ji who is the teacher of this course we can we can't describe his panditya or his vaidushya in a small introduction the first attribute which i would like to tell regarding lalit ji is his acharya bhakti he is a devotee of the shringeri parampara and his acharya bhakti has given him the necessary gnanam to do the prachara of the acharya granthas shringeri jagat guru bodhi gurus have told him that please do the prachara of acharya granthas so acharya grantha shlokas can also be there we can also consider the shlokas we can also consider the prakarana granthas we can consider the vedanta texts but lalit ji prefer to start with sadhana panchaka and it is a great opportunity for all of us who have joined here मनुष्या सहस्रेशु कश्चिदति सिद्धये सो हू हवर हैव जॉन टुडे आर द पुण्य आत्मा हू आर रेडी टू लिजन टू द आचार्य उपदेश थ्रू अवर ललित जी सो ललित जी हेज स्टडीड वेद व्याकरण तर्क एंड ही आलो fosters the avadhana kala he is a avadhani and it is a special kala bharatiya kala where initially ashtavadhana is one kala where it is a first level where you have eight scholars questioning a a, a learned person on various aspects trying to test his focus and concentration and his avadhanam <clears throat> which is the which is the word so he has learnt this kala and he is also learnt vedanta under various reputed scholars the avadhana kala he has learnt from sri mahadevamani garu vyakarana from padmanabha ashrama garu and great scholars tarka from vishwanath gopal shastri garu kutumb shastri from shri kutumb shastri he has learned the vedanta they are all his the gurus that are listed on this slide are the greatest of the 
gurus in those areas and it is only because of his acharya bhakti he has secured this knowledge from them that is the only trait i would like to tell about lalit ji uh, and he is a wonderful teacher a wonderful discourse person, person. please uh, listen to the discourse or the patha with shraddha shraddha is very very required park your doubts for the question answer session do, do not disturb him in the middle park all your doubts at the this uh, during the question and sessions as and then you can get it clarified but what is most required is the shraddha he has various achievements which you can read from the course page i would thank lalit ji for taking for considering vyoma to do his to do the prachar of acharya granthas and uh, request him to start this course with prarthana to the jagat gurus ram ram ಶ್ರೀಗುರುಭ್ಯೋ ನಮಃ ನಮಸ್ಭ್ಯ ಸಭಾಪತಿಭ್ಯ ವೋ ನಮಃ ವಾಗೀಶಾದ್ಯಾಸುಮನಸರ್ವಾಕ್ರಮೇ ಯಂ ನಕೃತ್ಯಾಸ್ತನ್ನಮಿ ಗಜಾನನ ಶಾರದಾ ಶಾರದಾ ಭೋಜವದನಾಪದನಾಂಬುಜೇ ಸರ್ವಾಸ್ಮಾ ಸನ್ನಿಧಿ ಸನ್ನಿಧಿ ಕ್ರಿಯಾತ್ ಸದಾ ಶಿವ ಸಾರಂಭಾ ಶಂಕರಾಚಾರ್ಯ ಮಧ್ಯ ಅಸ್ಮದಾಚಾರ್ಯ ಪರ್ಯಂತ ವಂದೇ ಗುರು ಪರಂಪರಾಂ ಓಂ ನಮೋ ನಾರಸಿಂಹಾಯ ವಜ್ರದಂಶ್ರಾ ವಜ್ರಣೆ ವಜ್ರದೇಹಾಯ ವಜ್ರಾಯ ನಮೋ ವಜ್ರನಖಾಯ ವಾಗರ್ಥಾವಿವ ಸಂಪೃಕ್ತ ವಾಗರ್ಥ ಪ್ರತಿಪತ್ತ ಜಗತ ಪಿತರೋ ವಂದೇ ಪಾರ್ವತಿ ಪರಮೇಶ್ವರೋ ಭಾರತೀ ಕರುಣಾಪಾತ್ರ ಭಾರತೀ ಪದಭೂಷಣ ಭಾರತೀ ಪದಮಾರೂಢ ಭಾರತೀ ತೀರ್ಥಮಾಶ್ರಯ ವಿದ್ಯಾನಯ ಸಂಪನ್ನ ವೇತರಾಗಂ ವಿವೇಕಿನ ವಂದೇ ವೇದಾಂತತ್ವಜ್ಞ ವಿಧುಶೇಖರ ಭಾರತೀ ಶ್ರುತಿಸ್ಮೃತಿಪುರಾಣಾಲಯ ಕರುಣಾಲಯ ನಮಿ ಭಗವತ್ಪಾದಶಂಕರ ಲೋಕಶಂಕರ ಸದ್ಗುರುಚರಣಾರವಿಂದಭ್ಯಹ ನಮಃ ನಮಸ್ಕಾರ ಎವ್ರಿ ಒನ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಐ ಬಿಡ್ ಯು ಆಲ್ ಎ ವೆರಿ ಹಾರ್ಟಿ ಸ್ವಾಗತ ಟು ದಿಸ್ ಕ್ಲಾಸ್ uh first i would like to thank the vyoma platform its organizers venkat mohodaya everyone it is a massive uh, organizational uh, effort it is a very dedicated effort that has given us this platform to speak about such sadvishayas with so first of all offering namaskaras and gratitude to them uh as venkat mohodaya mentioned it is the jagat guru's wish that we all study the granthas of bhagavad pada so i will give a quick introduction about that before i go into the subject material so bhagavad pada is the main individual that we look up to for advaita prachara so as we know we have several philosophies of those the one that we subscribe to is advaita which which teaches the aikya the unity of the jivatma and paramatma as undivided consciousness uh, ekarasa chaitanya so this does not start with bhagavad pada though. there is a whole parampara this guru parampara of this vidya of this vedanta vidya stretches all the way back to paramatma either narayana or shiva you say we say sada shiva samarambham or also narayana samarambham both parts are there so it starts with paramatma and then has been passed down through a rishi parampara vashishta maharshi shakti vyasa uh, shuka all of these uh, gurus the rishi parampara and then it comes to the manushya parampara where you have gauda bhagavat pada acharya who wrote the mandukya karikas govinda bhagavat pada acharya and then bhagavat pada shankara bhagavat pada acharya so this is an old parampara but what bhagavat pada did was the reason why although out of such an illustrious parampara where everyone is a brahma gyani the reason why bhagavat pada shines first and foremost and why he is so popular these days not just in the you know the cultural sense but in the academic sense too is because bhagavad pada laid out a system he he systematized this vedanta sadhana until then there were granthas here and there 
and you know mahatmas have written them and they are complete in their own right but in terms of providing a holistic set of literature to teach vedanta none no one did that better than bhagavad pada so that is the reason why acharyas are so insistent that bhagavad pada's teachings be studied that bhagavad pada's uh, that bhagavad pada's uh granthas be studied why bhagavad pada's literature be studied why bhagavad pada's parampara be popularized so that is the reason why we have chosen bhagavad pada sadhana panchaka and now we have chosen bhagavad pada but what of his writings should we should we talk about because he has written several stotras several granthas so at the most at the most scholarly level the prasthanatri bhashya the bhashya for the brahma sutras for bhagavad gita for the upanishads is a very scholarly text Uh, and uh, in a class setting going in an online class setting it is a bit hard to go through the bhashya and what not and then in the in the very base level we have the stotra granthas so you know we have uh, nishivananda lahari saundarya lahari ganesha panchatna rama bhujanga shiva bhujanga subramanya bhujanga all of these stotra some of which uh, which have been taught through yona as well uh, i know at least that subramanya bhujanga and saundarya lahari and shivananda lahari have been taught so we have these stotras as well in the middle so not completely stotra granthas and not completely scholarly texts we have another genre called prakarana granthas so a prakarana quite frankly is shastra ek desha sambandhi it it takes upon one area of shastra so for example there is one text called panchikarana uh, it is attributed to bhagavad pada acharya so panchikarana talks about the way that the paramatma and avyakta Uh, manifested this world how does the process of panchikarana happen panchikarana is the process of how the sukshma bhutas become the sthula bhutas and sthula srishti happens so that is one process so this panchikarana talks about that another prakarana grantha of sureshwara acharya is naishkarmya siddhi so it talks about how to relinquish the how to become uh, a naishkarmi for example naishkarmya siddhi paramam sanyasena adhigachati comes in bhagavad gita Uh, and uh, sureshwara acharya takes upon latches upon that word and then talks about how to attain that state and then in such ways there are different um, there are different prakarana granthas that are given to us in vedanta so what bhagavad pada did in the sadhana panchaka is there are for there are five verses it is a sadhana panchaka so five verses in each verse there are four padas these are all in the chanda shardola vikriyata masarasa dataga ganas all of those kavitva lakshanas we can see all the chandva lakshanas we can see but uh, in the sadhana panchaka these are all shardula uh, shlokas shardula vikrita shlokas in each pada there will be two halves so each pada will include two commands uh, commands in the sense that what we should do how should we do our sadhana vedo nityam adhiyatam one uh, you know one Uh, is that is one command tadudhitam karma svanushthi yatam another command this is one pada the next pada tene shasya vidhi yatam apachiti another uh, command kamye matistyajyatam another command so in this way through the course of these five shlokas bhagavad pada gives us 40 commands to follow the way that they are laid out is very interesting the sequence the reason why he puts one after the other is also something to look at because whenever acharya purusha say anything as venkat mohadeya said shraddha shraddha is very important right so shraddha is twofold shastrasya guru vakyasya satya buddhya avadharana sa shraddha kathita sadbhihi yena vastu upapadyate yena vastu upalabhyate is what bhagavad pada gives us in uh, in viveka chodamani so there as he talks about the shamadi shatka sampatti he defines shraddha so shastrasya guru vakyasya satya buddhya avadharana so sitting with the firm belief that what shastra says is true this satya and what the guru says is true so basically that the guru is telling shastra that is the faith that we are looking for that shastra is true that the drashtas and munis and maharshis that have given us this literature that they were all truly realized that they had the guru lakshanas what are the guru lakshanas again go guru adhigata tattva shishya hitaya udyata satatam this is what bhagavad pada says in prashnotra ratnamalika so it is kind of like a regression of texts but the point we are looking at is a guru is someone who has understood tattva who has understood this jnana and then he is adhigata tattva and also shishya hita udyata he not only has proper understanding of jnana but he is also ever vigilant ever interested in uplifting the shishyas in teaching the shishyas in ensuring the welfare of the shishyas in giving the shishyas shreyas 
so we need to have the conviction that the guru is of such nature and also that the shastra has been given by such gurus right so that is the the faith so here the guru is not uh, you know it is not me or someone else but the guru here is bhagavat pada he is jagat guru and uh, sanidhanam varu has defined what it means not not sanidhanam varu actually uh, sachidananda shiva abhinav rasanna bharati swami uh, the 33rd acharya of the sharada peetham he defined what jagat guru means because people are very confused does it mean that he is a guru to the world some people have given the vigraha vakya jagadeva guru hu yasya one to whom the jagat is a guru uh, there are several meanings given but the meaning that uh, that that acharya gave was if anyone in the jagat gets a doubt if anyone in the jagat has some spiritual query if anyone in the jagat needs spiritual guidance and they come and ask it is my duty to guide them that is what it means for me to be a jagat guru i have the duty to help anyone in this world that comes to me with spiritual doubts and that same name is applied to bhagavat pada as he has given us through his writings something for every kind of sadhaka for someone that is starting from ground zero there is something for a very great pandita there is something for an upasaka there is something for a karma yogi there is something for a gnana yogi there is something so uh, the request is that we sit here not just learning these five shlokas and memorizing them and going off but also understanding that these are very real things that we can apply to our lives that acharya wanted us to apply to our lives that, that bhagavat pada wanted us to apply to our lives after we learn them so that is the sadhana panchaka that we will be doing as far as the course breakdown goes uh, today we will be doing uh, chanting kandhasthikaran and pathana of all the five shlokas there is also a, a parashruti that we can do on the last day but today i will be teaching all the five shlokas and kind of in the end i will give a uh, given the amount of time we have at the end i will give a Uh, a breakdown of kind of why did bhagavat pada choose the sadhana panchaka panchaka to be directed in the vedanta sense and then what we will do over the next 5 days is each day we will once again uh, do a chanting of the shloka and then that day i will speak about the shloka the meaning of that shloka i will explain it and then we will have some 10 15 minutes in the end of class to leave for questions and uh, clarifications and doubts and uh, such so today also i will try to leave uh, just 5 minutes at the end because as we are only doing kantasthi karna today there is not much subject matter but uh, that is how we will uh, go forward in this class so uh, before we start the sadhana panchaka i would like to just quickly teach another prarthana shloka to uh bhagavat pada one second okay so uh, lakshman ji is here and he will be uh, repeating after me uh, lakshman ji hari om ah namaste mahodaya even rasya bhagini is here so ha ah, rasya bhagini is here ha yeah both of you can repeat i i had asked lasya yeah. uh, and uh, yeah so both of you can repeat that would be very nice mm-hmm. so first this is a prarthana shloka to bhagavat pada Uh, sanidhanam varu is very fond of telling the shloka as his prarthana shloka before his anugraha bhashana so i thought we would learn this shloka and then proceed shri mate shankararyaya shri mate shankararyaya shri mate shankararyaya dhimate adbhuta shaktaye dhimate adbhuta shaktaye धीमते अद्भुत शक्तये श्रीमते शंकरार्याय श्रीमते शंकरार्याय श्रीमते शंकरार्याय धीमते अद्भुत शक्तये धीमते अद्भुत शक्तये धीमते अद्भुत शक्तये नमोस्तु अद्वैत सिद्धांत 
नमोस्तु अद्वैत सिद्धांत नमोस्तु अद्वैत सिद्धांत स्थापनोपात्तमूर्त 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 श्रीमते शंकरार्याय भीमते भूतशक्त श्रीमते शंकरार्याय धीमते भूतशक्त श्रीमते शंकरार्याय धीमते भूतशक्त नमोस्वैत सिद्धांत नमोस्वैत सिद्धांत नमोस्वैत सिद्धांत स्थापनोपात्तमूर्त 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 श्रीमते शंकरार्याय भीमते भूतशक्त श्रीमते शंकरार्याय धीमते भूतशक्त श्रीमते शंकरार्याय धीमते भूतशक्त नमोस्वैत सिद्धांत स्थापनोपात्तमूर्त नमोस्वैत सिद्धांत स्थापनोपात्तमूर्त नमोस्वैत सिद्धांत स्थापनोपात्तमूर्त सो दिस इज द दिस इज द श्लोक श्रीमते श्रीमते शंकरार्याय धीमते भूतशक्त नमोस्वैत सिद्धांत स्थापनोपात्तमूर्त सो क्विक मीनिंग दिस इज नमस्कार टू भगवत् शंकरार्याय नम He he is referred to as Shankar Arya, not Shankar Acharya. Arya means someone who has a very dharmic character, very pure conduct. Is referred to as Acharya. Harat Papavartmana Durat Vartate is the definition for Arya. So one who is very pure in character is an Arya. So Namaskaram to that Shankar Arya who is a Dhimat. He is a Dhimat, meaning he is very wise. Adbhuta Shaktaye. He is not only wise; he is also very capable. Looking at the things he did, the Chaturshpita Pratishthapana, the Bhashyas he did, the Vadas he did, his His capacity is also very great. Namaskaram to him. And namostu advaita siddhanta sthapano patta murtaye. He took upon a murti. He took upon a form for the sole purpose of advaita siddhanta sthapana to enforce the siddhanta of advaita. It is not advaita advaita siddhanta rachano patta murtaye. He did not create it. He enforced it. Right. So that is the his avatara karya, and that is why we are sitting here today happily in the twenty first century, able to study. You know all these texts. So, namaskaram to him. We will move into the into the text proper. So, the way we will do this is, I will tell uh, one half of the line. We will repeat that twice, and then I'll tell the next half of the line. Repeat that twice, and then the whole line will be repeated twice. And then in the end, uh, last year can tell the whole shloka. So, the parts of the shloka Lakshman Mahadeva can do. In the end, the whole shloka last year. Can. वेदो 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 तदुदित कर्म स्वनुष्ठीयता तदुदित कर्म स्वनुष्ठीयता तदुदित कर्म स्वनुष्ठीयता वेदो निधीयता वेदो निधीयता तदुदित कर्म स्वनुष्ठीयता तदुदित कर्म स्वनुष्ठीयता तदुदित कर्म स्वनुष्ठीयता तेनेशस्य विधीयतामपचिति 
भवसुखे दोषो नो 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 निजगृहा निजगृहा Asya, do you want to do the halves of shlokas? Vedo nitya madhiyatam taduditam karma svanushtiyatam teneshasya vidhiyatam apachitihi kamye matistyajyatam Vedo nitya madhiyatam taduditam karma svanushtiyatam teneshasya vidhiyatam apachitihi निजगृहा पापौ घफ परिधूयताम भव सुखे दोषो नु संधीयताम आत्मेच्छा व्यवसीयताम निज ग्रहात तूर्णम विनिर्गम्यताम वेदो नित्यमधीयताम तदुदितम कर्म स्वनुष्ठीयताम तेनेशस्य विधीयताम अपचितिहि काम्ये मतिस्त्यज्यताम पापौ घफ परिधूयताम भव सुखे दोषो नु संधीयताम आत्मेच्छा व्यवसीयताम निज गृहात तूर्णम विनिर्गम्यताम दैट इज द फर्स्ट श्लोका सेकंड श्लोका संगसत्सु विधीयताम संगसत्सु विधीयताम संगसत्सु विधीयताम भगवतो भक्तिर दृढाधीयताम भगवतो भक्तिर दृढाधीयताम भगवतो भक्त 
ಶಾಂತ್ಯಾಪರಿಚೀಯತಾಂತ್ಯಾಪರಿಚೀಯತಾಂ ದೃಢತರಂ ಕರ್ಮಾಶು ಸಂತ್ಯಜ್ಯತಾಂ ದೃಢತರಂ ಕರ್ಮಾಶು ಸಂತ್ಯಜ್ಯತಾಂ ದೃಢತರಂ ಕರ್ಮಾಶು ಸಂತ್ಯಜ್ಯತಾಂ ಸದ್ವಿದ್ವಾನುಪಸರ್ಪ್ಯತಾಂ 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 ಪ್ರತಿದಿನಂತ್ಪಾದುಕಾಸೇವ್ಯತಾಂ ಶ್ರುತಿಶಿರೋವಾಕ್ಯಂ ಸಮಾಕರ್ಣ್ಯತ ಶ್ರುತಿಶಿರೋವಾಕ್ಯಂಕರ್ಣ್ಯ ಶ್ರುತಿಶಿರೋವಾಕ್ಯಂಕರ್ಣ್ಯಾಂತ್ಯಾಪರಿಚೀಯತಾಂತರಂ ಕರ್ಮಾಶು ಸಂತ್ಯಜ್ಯತಾಂ ಸಂಗಸತ್ಸು ವಿಧೀಯತಾಂ ಭಗವತೋ ಭಕ್ತಿರ್ದೃಢಾಧೀಯತಾಂ ಶಾಂತ್ಯಾಪರಿಚೀಯತಾಂ ದೃಢತರಂ ಕರ್ಮಾಶು ಸಂತ್ಯಜ್ಯತಾಂ ಸಂಗಸತ್ಸು ವಿಧೀಯತಾಂ ಭಗವತೋ ಭಕ್ತಿರ್ದೃಢಾಧೀಯತಾಂ ಶಾಂತ್ಯಾಪರಿಚೀಯತಾಂ ದೃಢತರಂ ಕರ್ಮಾಶು ಸಂತ್ಯಜ್ಯತಾಂ Give a space between Parichayatam and Dridhataram because that is where the Agnya is ending. Dridhataram Karmasha Sankhijitam is the next one. Sadvidvanupasarpyatam Pratidinam Tatpaduka Sevyatam Brahmhaikaksharamarthyatam Shruti Shirovakyam Samakarnyatam Sadvidvanupasarpyatam Pratidinam Tatpaduka Sevyatam ಬ್ರಹ್ಮೈಕಾಕ್ಷರಮರ್ಥ್ಯತಾಂ ಶ್ರುತಿಶಿರೋವಾಕ್ಯಂ ಸಮಾಕರ್ಣ್ಯತಾಂ ಸದ್ವಿದ್ವಾನುಪಸರ್ಪ್ಯತಾಂ ಪ್ರತಿದಿನಂ ತತ್ಪಾದುಕಾ ಸೇವ್ಯತಾಂ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮೈಕಾಕ್ಷರಮರ್ಥ್ಯತಾಂ ಶ್ರುತಿಶಿರೋವಾಕ್ಯಂ ಸಮಾಕರ್ಣ್ಯತಾಂ ಸಂಗಸತ್ಸು ಭಗವತೋ ಭಕ್ತಿರ್ದೃಢಾಧೀಯತಾಂ ಶಾಂತ್ಯಾಪರಿಚೀಯತಾಂ ದೃಢತರಂ ಕರ್ಮಾಶು ಸಂತ್ಯಜ್ಯತಾಂ ಸದ್ವಿದ್ವಾನುಪಸರ್ಪ್ಯತಾಂ 
प्रतिदिनं तत्पादुका सेवित सेव्यताम ब्रह्मैक ब्रह्मैकाक्षरमर्थ्यताम श्रुतिशिरो वाक्यम समाकर्ण्यताम वेरी नाइस आज द थर्ड श्लोक वाक्यार्थश्च विचार्यताम वाक्यार्थश्च विचार्यताम वाक्यार्थश्च विचार्यताम श्रुति शिरफ पक्ष समाश्रीयताम श्रुति शिरफ पक्ष समाश्रीयताम श्रुति शिरफ पक्ष समाश्रीयताम वाक्यार्थश्च विचार्यताम वाक्यार्थश्च विचार्यताम वाक्यार्थश्च विचार्यताम श्रुति शिरफ पक्ष समाश्रीयताम श्रुति शिरफ पक्ष समाश्रीयताम श्रुति शिरफ पक्ष समाश्रीयताम दुस्तरकात सुविरम्यताम दुस्तरकात सुविरम्यताम दुस्तरकात सुविरम्यताम श्रुति मतस्तर कोनु संधियताम श्रुति मतस्तर कोनु संधियताम श्रुति मतस्तर कोनु संधियताम दुस्तरकात सुविरम्यताम दुस्तरकात सुविरम्यताम दुस्तरकात सुविरम्यताम श्रुति मतस्तर कोनु संधियताम श्रुति मतस्तर कोनु संधियताम श्रुति मतस्तर कोनु संधियताम ब्रह्मास्मिति विभाव्यताम ब्रह्मास्मिति विभाव्यताम ब्रह्मास्मिति विभाव्यताम आहारा हर गर्वफ परित्यज्यताम आहारा हर गर्वफ परित्यज्यताम आहारा हर गर्वफ परित्यज्यताम देहे हम मति रुज्यताम देहे हम मति रुज्यताम देहे हम मति रुज्यताम बुधजनेर वादफ परित्यज्यताम बुधजनेर वादफ परित्यज्यताम बुधजनेर वादफ परित्यज्यताम ब्रह्मास्मिति विभाव्यताम ब्रह्मास्मिति विभाव्यताम ब्रह्मास्मिति विभाव्यताम आहारा हर गर्वफ परित्यज्यताम आहारा हर गर्वफ परित्यज्यताम आहारा हर गर्वफ परित्यज्यताम देहे हम मति रुज्यताम देहे हम मति रुज्यताम देहे हम मति रुज्यताम बुधजनेर वादफ परित्यज्यताम बुधजनेर वादफ परित्यज्यताम बुधजनेर वादफ परित्यज्यताम That's it. When you repeat the halves of the shlokas, you can just do it once. Uh, I think twice is practice. Vakyarthascha vicharyatam Shruti shiraf pak Shasamashriyatam Dustarkat suviram yatam Shruti matas tarko nusandhiyatam Vakyarthascha vicharyatam Shruti shiraf pakshasamashriyatam Dustarkat suviram yatam Shruti matas tarko nusandhiyatam ब्रह्मास्मिति विभाव्यताम आहारा हर गर्वफ परित्यज्यताम देहे हम मति रुज्यताम बुधजनेर वादफ परित्यज्यताम 
ब्रह्मास्मीति विभाव्यताम अहरहर गर्व परित्यज्यताम देहे हम मति रुज्यताम बुध जनेर वाद परित्यज्यताम वाक्यार्थश्च विचार्यताम श्रुति शिरफ पक्ष समाश्रियताम दुस्तर्कात्सु विरम्यताम श्रुति मतस्तर्को नुसंधियताम ब्रह्मास्मीति विभाव्यताम अहरहर गर्व परित्यज्यताम देहे हम मति रुज्यताम बुध जनेर वाद परित्यज्यताम प्रतिदिनं भिक्षोषधं भुज्यताम् प्रतिदिनं भिक्षोषधं भुज्यताम् प्रतिदिनं भिक्षोषधं भुज्यताम् क्षुद्व्याधिश्च चिकित्स्यताम् क्षुद्व्याधिश्च चिकित्स्यताम् क्षुद्व्याधिश्च चिकित्स्यताम् प्रतिदिनं भिक्षोषधं भुज्यताम् प्रतिदिनं भिक्षोषधं भुज्यताम् प्रतिदिनं भिक्षोषधं भुज्यताम् स्वाद्वन्नम् नतुयाच्यताम् स्वाद्वन्नम् नतुयाच्यताम् स्वाद्वन्नम् नतुयाच्यताम् विधिवशात् प्राप तेन संतुष्यताम् विधिवशात् प्राप्ते न संतुष्यताम् विधिवशात् प्राप्ते न संतुष्यताम् स्वाद्वन्नम् न तु याच्यताम् स्वाद्वन्नम् न तु याच्यताम् स्वाद्वन्नम् न तु याच्यताम् विधिवशात् प्राप प्राप्ते न संतुष्यताम् विधिवशात् प्राप्ते न संतुष्यताम् विधिवशात् प्राप्ते न संतुष्यताम् शीतोष्णादि विशक्यताम् शीतोष्णादि विशक्यताम् शीतोष्णादि विशक्यताम् न तु वृथा वाक्यम् समुच्चार्यताम् नतुवृथावाक्यम् समुच्चार्यताम् नतुवृथावाक्यम् समुच्चार्यताम् शीतोष्णादि विशक्यताम् शीतोष्णादि विशक्यताम् शीतोष्णादि विशक्यताम् नतुवृथावाक्यम् समुच्चार्यताम् न तु वृथा वाक्यम् समुच्चार्यताम् न तु वृथा वाक्यम् समुच्चार्यताम् अवदासीन्यम् अभिप्सयताम् अवदासीन्यम् अभिप्सयताम् अवदासीन्यम् अभिप्सयताम् जनक्रपानाइष्ठुर्यमुत्सर्ज्यताम् जनक्रपानेष्ठुर्यमुत्सर्ज्यताम् जनक्रपानेष्ठुर्यमुत्सर्ज्यताम् अवदासीन्यमभिप्सयताम् 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 जनक्रपानेष्ठुर्यमुत्सर्ज्यताम् 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 कासे क्षुद्व्याधिश्च चिकित्स्यताम् 
प्रतिदिनं भिक्षोषधं भुज्यताम स्वाद्वन्न तो याच्यताम विधिवशात प्राप्ते न संतुष्यताम क्षुद्व्याधिश्च चिकित्स्यताम प्रतिदिनं भिक्षोषधं भुज्यताम स्वाद्वन्न तो याच्यताम विधिवशात प्राप्ते न संतुष्यताम शीतोष्णादिविषह्यताम न तो वृथा वाक्यं समुच्चार्यताम औदासीन्यमभीप्स्यताम जनकृपानैष्ठर्यमुत्सृज्यताम शीतोष्णादि विषह्यताम न तो वृथा वाक्यं समुच्चार्यताम औदासीन्यमभीप्स्यताम जनकृपानैष्ठर्यमुत्सृज्यताम क्षुद्व्या चिकित्स्यताम प्रतिदिन भिक्षौषधं भुज्यताम स्वाद्वन्न तो याच्यताम विधिवशा प्राप्ते न संतुष्यता शीतोष्णादिविषह्यताम न तो वृथा वाक्यं समुच्चार्यताम औदासीन्यमीप्स्यता जनकृपानैष्ठुर्यमुत्सृज्यता That is the fourth shloka, the last shloka of the panchaka. Ekante sukhamasyatam. Ekante sukhamasyatam. Ekante sukhamasyatam. Paratare chetas samadhiyatam. Paratare chetas samadhiyatam. परतरे चेतस्समाधीयताम एकांतेसुखमास्यताम परतरे चेतस्समाधीयताम एकांतेसुखमास्यताम परतरे चेतस्समाधीयताम एकांतेसुखमास्यताम परतरे चेतस्समाधीयताम पूर्णात्मा सुसमीक्ष्यताम पूर्णात्मा सुसमीक्ष्यताम पूर्णात्मा सुसमीक्ष्यताम जगदीदम तद्बाधितम दृश्यताम जगदीदम तद्बाधितम दृश्यताम जगदीदम तद्बाधितम दृश्यताम पूर्णात्मा सुसमीक्ष्यताम पूर्णात्मा सुसमीक्ष्यताम पूर्णात्मा सुसमीक्ष्यताम जगदीदम तद्बाधितम दृश्यताम जगदीदम तद्बाधितम दृश्यताम जगदीदम तद्बाधितम दृश्यताम प्राकर्म प्रविलाप्यताम प्राकर्म प्रविलाप्यताम प्राकर्म प्रविलाप्यताम चिति बलान्नाप्युत्तरै श्लिष्यताम चिति बलान्नाप्युत्तरै श्लिष्यताम चिति बलान्नाप्युत्तरे श्लिष्यताम प्राकर्म प्रविलाप्यताम प्राकर्म प्रविलाप्यताम प्राकर्म प्रविलाप्यताम चिति बलान्नाप्युत्तरे श्लिष्यताम चिति बलान्नाप्युत्तरे श्लिष्यताम चिति बलान्नाप्युत्तरे श्लिष्यताम प्रारब्धम त्विहभुज्यताम प्रारब्धम त्विहभुज्यताम प्रारब्धम त्विहभुज्यताम अथ परब्रह्मात्मनास्थीयताम अथ परब्रह्मात्मनास्थीयताम 
अथ पर ब्रह्मात्मनास्थीयताकर्म प्रविलाप्यताकर्म प्रविलाप्यताकर्म प्रविलाप्यता चितिबलाप्युतरैश्लिष्यता चितिबलाप्युतरैश्लिष्यता अथ पर ब्रह्मात्मनास्थीयता अथ पर ब्रह्मात्मनास्थीयता इंटरेस्टिंग थिंग हियर यूजुअली शास्त्र स्टार्ट विद अथ अथ तो धर्म जिज्ञास अथ तो ब्रह्म जिज्ञास अथ शब्द अनुशासन हियर इंटरेस्टिंगली अथ कम्स इन द लास्ट विधि दैट भगवत पद के साथ अथ पर ब्रह्मात्मनास्थीयता व्हाई दैट केम वी विल टॉक अबाउट व्हेन वी टॉक अबाउट दिस श्लोक एकांते सुखमास्यताम परतरे चेतस्समाधीयताम पूर्णात्मा सुसमीक्ष्यता जगदीदृश्यतातरे चेत सीयता पूर्णात्मा सुसमीक्ष्यता जगदीदृश्यताकर्म प्रविलाप्यता चिबला प्राकर्म प्रविलाप्यताकर्मिलाप्यताबलाप्युतरैश्लिष्यता प्रारब्धुज्यताकर्म प्रविलाप्यता कर्मकांड after some kratu or some you know some sadhyaskara something has been given some vidhi of some karma has been done afterwards they will tell you what the phala is so not in the vidhi vakya where it's like karyariya ishtika vrishtika maya jeta or agnihotra na sarga ka not there where they say if you desire this you should do this in the end after i mean i say in the end in vela these are not in order but after the karma is outlined in the end they will say something labhate Right? They will they will say what that what that kratu uh, or what that karma will give. So that is called phalashrute. So you will see in Mimamsa text they will say iti phalashrute hai. So they, because this karma is set because this phala is said to be given for this karma because phalashrute. Shrute means to be said by shrute is what we is how it is taken in Shastra. Phalashrute means the place where you hear Veda talk about the phala. so that is where the term phalashruti originated over time it became applied to all other stotras and uh, you know kavachas or whatever we think parayana of something will give us a phala what or not even just parayana whatever we think will give us a phala it has become practice over time to write a shloka detailing what that phala is and then we call it the phalashruti but i just wanted to point out that as with as the case with literally everything else in sanatana dharma this also is vaidika in its origin this also has vedic roots this phalashruti concept so sh- small shlokam yash shloka panchakam idam yash shloka panchakam idam 
श्लोक पंचकमीद पठते मनुष्य पठते मनुष्य पठते मनुष्य यश्लोक पंचकमीद पठते मनुष्य यश्लोक पंचकमीद पठते मनुष्य यश्लोक पंचकमीद पठते मनुष्य संचिंतुदीन 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 स्थिरतामुपेत्यतामुपेत्यतामुपेत्यचिंतुदीन स्थिरतामुपेत्य संचिंतुदीन स्थिरतामुपेत्य संचिंतुदीन स्थिरतामुपेत्य तस्याशु 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 संस्रति दवानलती व्रघोर संस्रति दवानलती व्रघोर संस्रति दवानलती व्रघोर तस्याशु संस्रति दवानलती व्रघोर तस्याशु संस्रति दवानलती व्रघोर तस्याशु संस्रति दवानलती व्रघोर ताप प्रशाति मुपयाति ताप प्रशाति मुपयाति ताप प्रशाति मुपयाति चिति प्रसादात चिति प्रसादात चिति प्रसादात ताप प्रशाति मुपयाति चिति चिति प्रसादात ताप प्रशाति मुपयाति चिति प्रसादात ताप प्रशाति मुपयाति चिति प्रसादात यश्लोक पंचकमीद पठते मनुष्य संचिंतुदीन स्थिरतामुपेत्य यश्लोक पंचकमीद पठते मनुष्य संचिंतुदीन स्थिरतामुपेत्य तस्याशु संस्रति दवानलती व्रघोर ताप प्रशाति मुपयाति चिति तस्याशु संस्रति दवानलती व्रघोर ताप प्रशाति मुपयाति चिति प्रसादात यश्लोक पंचकमीद पठते मनुष्य संचिंतुदीन स्थिरतामुपेत्य तस्याशु संस्रति दवानलती व्रघोर ताप प्रशांति मुपयाति चिति प्रसादात सो दो जो द फाइव श्लोकस प्लस द फलश्रुति दैट वी हैव कवर्ड टुडे सो द वे विल डू इट इज टुमारो वी विल बी टॉकिंग अबाउट द अर्थ फॉर द फर्स्ट श्लोका सो वी विल वंस अगेन डू चैंटिंग फॉर दैट इन द बिगिनिंग शुड नॉट टेक मोर देन 2 और 3 मिनट्स एंड देन फॉर अबाउट 45 मिनट्स आई विल स्पीक अबाउट द मीनिंग द लास्ट 10 मिनट्स वी कैन कीप फॉर क्वेश्चंस एंड आंसर्स सो दैट इज ऑल द टीचिंग आई हैव फॉर टुडे Uh, I am free for another five to ten minutes. If uh, anyone wants to ask questions, how you will unmute and all, I'm actually not sure, but uh, I'm I'm available for questions and answers if uh, you have any. Mahodaya, so as they are in the attendees panel, if they raise their hand, you will be able to unmute. Okay, so yep, that is the protocol. So if anyone raises their hand, we can unmute you. If there are no questions and we all have Brahma Gyan on the first day, our job will be made much easier. Uh, Chandra Kala Ji, go ahead. Bhumati Bagi. Yes, sir. Uh, Chandra Kala Ji, you are unmuted. Uh, your hand is raised. I have unmuted. Namaste, Acharya. Namaste. Uh, in the second shloka. सर्प्यताम इन माय टेक्स्ट 
it should be sripyatam sripyatam i think also can work but let us do it as sripyatam uh, for now yeah sripyatam sarpyatam yeah uh, one sir pull up the text to see what is printed uh sadvidvam upasarpyatam is there i have seen both pathas sarpyatam and sripyatam both pathas i have seen we can do it as printed there which is sarpyatam okay yeah. thank you mohan ನಮಸ್ತೆ ಮಹೋದಯ ಅಹಮ್ಮೂರಿ ಐ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಒನ್ ಡೌಟ್ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಆನ್ ವಾಟ್ ಕಾಂಟೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಭಗವತ್ಪಾದ ಶಂಕರಾಚಾರ್ಯ ಸಾಧಕಾಶ್ So then upon that request they say that Bhagavad Pada composed this but there is no lore as to uh, what circumstances specifically prompted the rachana of this. Dhanyavada. Yeah. Hmm. Ah, Rema Kishore ji. Namaskara sir. Uh, truly happy and privileged to have been part of the class. Uh, I have a question which is not uh, entirely related to today's class. May I ask? Yes, go ahead. As long as it's about Vedanta. It is. Uh, I, am a, I am an amateur student of Srimad Bhagavatam. Uh, hmm. However, I uh, am stuck because I find it very difficult to go through the skandham 5 panchak panchama skandha because mm. it is entirely prose and there is no given chanda so mm. would you be able to enlighten us or anybody on the verma platform uh, how do i uh, proceed or how do i go about it i don't even have a clue how to go about that parayanam of panchama skandha okay so for parayanam uh, bhagavata parayana is there in several sampradayas so um, we would have to look into how a samp- particular sampradaya does parayana when they do bhagavata parayanas uh, i myself have not very conversant with the parayana vidhanas but uh, i am sure that there is someone on the uh, vyoma platform that can help with this um, as it is outside the purview of this class i think we will talk about it outside of class then so rema ji you can send a mail to us uh, i will reply to that mail there is surely an answer we have in vyoma for this thank you very much sir namaskara dhanyavad send a mail to support at vyomalabs.in i will thank you very much <clears throat> gomati ji if there are no questions you can uh, tell about the recordings and uh, the other things and we can close the class so let me share my screen so there are few webinar guidelines uh to as you may know to join the class there's only one way that is through the portal and uh, you please log in with your credentials at sanskritfromhome.org and then uh, in your dashboard it will automatically take you to the students dashboard and there in the today's class section you will have the link to join once a teacher starts the webinar you can join the class then uh, you will get three reminder three email reminder emails uh one 24 hours before the class 
and one hour before the class. And when the teacher starts the webinar, uh, immediately you will receive a mail. And you can join from your PC or Android or iOS devices. And please ensure that you have a headphone with mic to get the full utility of the class so that you will not be disturbed by your uh, surroundings. And also when you speak with the teacher and when you use a mic, you will not be disturbed um, and uh, any surrounding noise will not disturb you. You are uh, speak, uh, you are talking to the teacher and always ensure that you are in mute uh, so that it will not disturb others. Mostly you will be in mute and at times for questions you will be asked to unmute and after that, please ensure that you are in mute. And if you have any questions, please use a Q&A section also in between so that uh, uh, you may not disturb the teacher while the teacher is in the class. And you may also ask the questions during the question and answer section. And uh, if you have any questions, you please raise your hand so that we will unmute you. That is during the question and answer section, we will unmute you and you can answer the, you can uh, ask the questions to the teachers and they will answer. And uh, for this is especially for the users who use iOS devices. There is one setting known as pop-ups getting blocked, and uh, you please, you please, uh, uh, to get it uh, rectified, you please launch the settings and tap Safari, and under general section, click the toggle to toggle next to block pop block pop-ups to enable or disable the pop-up blocker. A green toggle indicates an enabled pop-up blocker. So, if it's not green, it is understood that it is a uh, blocked. Uh, it is uh, not blocked. And uh, if you enable pop-ups but are unable to generate a pop-up, refresh the web page uh, to regenerate the pop-up. Yeah, because only if the pop-up is not blocked, uh, the it, you can open the Zoom. Uh, you can open the class. And if the pop-up is generated from a link or the web page, click the link again. And after refreshing the web page, so. And uh, allow or block pop ups in Safari on Mac system. That is in the Mac system. Go to website in the Safari app, uh, choose Safari preferences, and then uh, click websites. Then click pop up windows on the left. If you don't see pop up windows, make sure you scroll to the bottom of the list. And in the pop up menu for the website, choose one of the following. There are three options either you can allow or block or block and notify. So, allow means the pop ups for the website will appear. And block and notify means the pop-ups for the website don't appear. But when you visit a website with pop-ups block, um, you can choose to show them by clicking in the smart search field. And block means the pop-ups should be completely blocked and don't appear. All the course materials and recordings will be uploaded in the course page. And uh, when you log in, it will automatically take you to the dashboard. Even if you go to navigate into any other page from the in the left corner on the left pad you have the dashboard as the first option and when you click it it will take you into the students dashboard and that you can find the link of all the courses registered by you in Vioma and from when you click on that course you can access the material specific to that course and one more important note please close all the other apps that use the internet either you may log in through mobile or a PC or laptop before logging in into the online class you please ensure that all the other apps that use the internet are closed so the video or audio lags might be resolved from your end and for any questions or doubts please email the same to sanskrit from home at vyomalabs.in or gannavaram lalitaditya.vyoma at gmail.com Dhanyavadaha Ram Ram Ram